We have the queen with us. That's right. Charlotte yes, is with the us. The queen herself. What's May that? she reign. <laughs> I always love Well, we need to start things off. This is my friend AJ. He I plays do. with the Washington Redskins, and yes. he's been hanging okay. out with me all morning. Yep. And I, I've now taken over his house, so I'm staying there. <laughs> yeah. uh, last night, I was impressed by the socks that he was wearing because he had some NWO socks on. But yeah. now, yes. Has- this is not on purpose. Are you wearing the Nature Boy socks? Woo! Oh, those are so cool. Oh, have you seen the pink ones? Those are awesome. Oh, yes. oh you have? Okay. Yeah, yeah I have. Yeah, I saw them at, um, I, I saw the both pairs at the yeah. fight shop at uh, in Vegas. And I ended up getting these ones because I had the pink oh, ones look like the great. Bret Hart ones I bought. Oh, okay. Yeah, but, but these ones are, yo. No, those are awesome. Yeah. They um, just sent me some Pumas. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I've heard about these Did limited about edition that? ones. Yeah. Because yeah. your, your pops is going to be doing something with, is it Foot, Lock, Foot Locker? Or? Yeah. Have they announced that? I heard it on, a, on a, to uh, say that. Uh, uh, Cheap Heat. I heard them Okay, 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 good. So, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, I think it's All okay. Right. I'm like, I, okay. I my, he was talking about it with uh, Jim Ross on uh, Jim's podcast. Okay, sure. Yeah. You're fine. But, yeah, but I got a pair. But I'm always wondering, like, is it weird that I'm wearing shoes on my, <laughs> my feet? Is that awkward? No, it's okay. actually way more awesome. It's just than the you 80s, the, the bright colors. And oh, everything. yes. It's fun. Uh, I would wear shoes with my own face on them, so I don't think it's weird at all. Okay. I mean, I think it's I think it's much weirder than I'm okay, wearing. Okay, that was good. Right? I think it's much weirder than I'm wearing your father's face on my socks. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? No. Like, to me, that's, like, in this situation, when you're across the table, to me, that's weirder for me to be wearing it with your dad. Uh, if you was rocking no. the Pumas, yeah. See, I need a pair of those, but I don't think they make them my size. That's the problem. What size do you wear? 15. Oh. Yeah, that's yeah. not probably I'm not I'm sure wrong. they'll especially make them. Yeah, Maybe. Or just cut a hole and it could be like yeah. sandals. Or I'll just cut my toes yeah, off and get a 12. Yeah, just toe stick out. <laughs> <laughs> just cut them all off and just get Or a just 12. cut off the back and make it like a yeah. slipper. That would also work. And just slide my foot in yeah. and just hang off the back like a chancleta. Exactly. <laughs> How excited are you for WrestleMania? Last year you guys stole the show. And Absolutely. Now, now what's going to happen? We don't know, but I would imagine that it's going to be another epic match for you at WrestleMania. I, j- I think the pressure, though. Knowing yeah. I'm... Nervous because last year went so well. Oh, it was amazing. Um, so it adds to, like, how are we going to top last year? And that's, like, the only thing that's going through my mind. Um, but I'm super excited, and I'm happy, you know, not happy in terms of it'll be harder to win my title back, but the dynamics of a four-way um, yeah. is really cool. I'm so excited to see where you come, because every big match you always come up with that moonsault. And I'm, I'm excited to see where it's going to come from this Sunday. I know, I know you probably got something in store and it's going to be crazy. It always is. I am so excited to see what you do with that because you only bring it out in the big matches and every time you do, it just adds to pun intended, the flair of the match. <laughs> and and it, it's just, it separates how you perform well, like you always say, you're the queen of pay-per-view. You really are. Like when you go out and you put these matches on, on pay-per-view Thank you. they end up being I mean, how many matches with Sasha Banks last year you think could have been match of the year? Oh my gosh, three, I quit match. four. Yeah, I, no, I mean, yeah. off top, and oh, that doesn't. Yeah, one. That yeah, was, um, that, yeah. That was awesome. Right. That was then, then you throw in yeah. the triple threat match at Mania. I mean, you have you have a like just like your. I mean, I hate to say this, but just like your father, you have a history of making great match after great match after great match, and that's what separates you from a lot of other women in the division, and it makes you stand out. Even no, though all the there's women a lot. Are doing oh so. no, they are, but. I think that, to me personally, I think that you are in a class above everyone else. My personal opinion. Well, I I mean, you're only as good as your opponent. That is true. Um, So, a lot of that credit goes to my whoever I'm in the ring with. But um, for me, it's just a matter of uh, I never... well, I'm never, I just don't want to get complacent. Like, I feel yes. like I have to get better every time I'm on TV. I know that's like, <laughs> I know we're on TV every week, but yeah. I just think like, what, I need to, you know, this can be better, this can be better. And it's just the constant obsession for perfection. Yes. And um, that is my, like, I don't know. I just, I never think that I've reached that. It's just got to keep getting better. But I've said it before, for my money for the past year, you've been the best heel in WWE, male or female. And I, yeah. and I will say that to anyone. Do you see that, like, when you take on that role and you're like, I want to be the most hated person in the building, how do you get in that headspace? Like, how, because you're not that person right now. No, I it was tell. really hard. Um, it actually came from a lot of frustration. It was more, I had debuted and I was like, this is not what I'm supposed to be. Because I was a heel in NXT. And yeah. then, you know, they, 
that started to like me because you know they grew to they NXT saw me grow from ne my first match to my match with Natty. So um, also, you know being able to stick to a character like I wanted to stick to being a bad guy I needed to come out and wanted people to hate me and right. that's a matter of just staying consistent yeah and it's separating like okay you're just playing a character just because they you know they're yelling certain things or booing you know it's not you and it's being and able to shut that off and realize you know the more you can get them to hate you the better it is for it, it, it's, both people in the ring. This is a story. Everybody, Everybody yes, wins. Yes, wins. Absolutely. You win. Your opponent. Mm -hmm. win. I mean, so and honestly, a lot of times when you're the most hated person in the building, nobody wins more than your opponent. Like the the no, everyone wants them to beat you. Yeah. Everyone, and it just works for everyone. Well, yeah. I know we got to let you run because obviously oh, yeah. there's a million things going on. For sure. On. Uh, one last quick question. I, I listened to your pops on uh, Jim Ross's podcast. He mentioned something about you that I thought was pretty funny. I was hoping I'd run into you here. Oh, to ask you. no. He said that, he's like, my daughter is financially responsible, unlike her pops. Was there ever a moment where you were like, Dad, what are you spending money on? Like, where you're like, wow, what? why did you spend money on Because he was probably that? spending it on the kids. <laughs> no. But, um, yeah, I'm very conservative. Frugal. <laughs> That's smart. Other than my robes, but I'm like, oh, I'll make the investment back one day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you'll sell them. You'll sell them in ten years and make way more than you spent. But you know what? The, the, in in <laughs> fairness, though, to. my dad lives every day like it's his last. Yeah. And you can't say that. You meet many people like that, and I. That's what I admire about him. Yeah. Like I'm always like this little stress ball, and my dad's like, it'll work out. Hey, it'll work out. Live. It's like it's so. Um, I wish I could be like that in a way. Well, we appreciate you taking a few minutes. Yo, thanks and, for having uh, looking me. Looking forward to seeing what happens at WrestleMania. Oh, thank you, you so much. Best of luck to you. Thanks, guys. Thank you.